So talk to me more about the audiences because everything you just described sounds like it's been reaching people who um, have been viewers of Univision or listeners of Univision Radio, but the brand is expanding into new media and the target audience is, I presume, getting younger and perhaps even being bicultural. Our biggest growth is in the demographic of 18 to 34. So when we say Univision is deeply rooted in heritage and legacies, generations of families. Hispanics have an insatiable appetite for the content, content that emotionally bonds and connects with consumers. Um, sports, for example. We're home to soccer. And as these new youngsters come in and are passionate soccer fans, Univision is really where they can see their team that their family has grown up with and with the coverage that they expect from Univision. So our growth is really in the demographic of 18 to 34. They are into social media. They over-index in technology. And for us to be able to give them the brands that they want and delight them, we have had to move cross-platform. We are launching a brand new offering. It's called Uvideos, and it is our portable digital network and consumers will be able to consume all of Univision's content on that platform. That is how we remain relevant and also innovative. What challenges have you faced getting there? I think that the challenges that we face are no different than the challenges that other media companies face. We compete day in and day out with ABC, CBS, NBC, and Fox. And it is, whose competition? Is ABC competition or is Netflix competition? is Pandora competition. We have an offering that is cross-platform. So we have the number one radio uh, station group, as, as you guys know, as Interbrand is responsible for informing us on our architecture. You know, how do we have a coherent offering? And our competitive advantage is scale. And that the content that we're able to deliver is scalable across platforms. And challenging is making sure that those silos are broken and that the radio division is speaking to the network division and also maximizing opportunities. So if we have, for example, a partnership with the Latin Grammys, which we absolutely do and we have uh, a unique partnership with them, making sure that you know, all of our divisions are participating in it so that consumers obviously can then be able to consume different pieces of that. Well, the way they want to, because they're going to be sitting on their couch, they're going to be on their iPads, they're going to be consuming multiple media at the same time, so breaking through those silos is crucial. 